Hundreds stood in the audience to listen to the president speak. They got temperature checks before being allowed in. The bigger crowd actually wasn't in the audience. It was outside. Look at the hundreds, if not thousands, just outside the barricades, all Trump supporters. Some came by busload from other parts of the triad. WFMY News 2's Alma McCarty is also live in Winston-Salem tonight. Alma, Smith Reynolds Airport was packed. You spoke to some people as they walked into the event. We really did see busloads of people arrive here to see the president. And although this might not have been his biggest crowd to date, they were certainly enthusiastic. Make America great again, y'all. Hats, t-shirts, flags. Supporters of this message and of the president arrived in waves, hopping off charter buses eager to attend the campaign rally at Smith Reynolds Airport. Some, like Kim Doust, Trump 2020, have been diehard followers from the beginning. He does what he says and says what he does. You don't have to like him on a personal level, but he has gotten things done, and that's what I'm most happy about. Although he's too young to vote, Noah Galarza made the trip from Asheboro to see President Trump. I like Trump. I like what he stands for. He wants to keep our freedoms, and I just like him, who he is, yeah. Fredo Smith didn't always side with Trump. Let's just say when he was campaigning, I didn't take him serious. After a while, after he became president, I noticed he was sticking to his guns. A mile or so from the mostly unmasked crowd, a smaller group of protesters gathered unhappy with this campaign stop in their city. Annalise Sattler helped organize the protest. The message spread by Trump's campaign has been harmful to vulnerable communities since before he took office. Inviting that message into our community is something that we want to make clear we're just not about. There were some people that were protesting a little bit closer to the event, actually along North Liberty Street, not far from where I'm standing here, not far from the airport. Some were even driving past the airport in their cars, shouting things. But right now the road is back open and all of the spectators have gone home after this presidential campaign rally.